What's going on guys, Ron Man back again, and today is September 18th, which means the Super Mario 3D All-Stars collection comes out, and it got me thinking about what my favorite Super Mario games are. So here's my top five favorite Super Mario games. So before we get started, I'm just going to throw out there that this is not going to include Mario Parties, Mario Karts, or anything of the such. So let's get started. Coming in at number 5 is Super Mario Galaxy 2. Now I think this game is fantastic. I think Mario Galaxy is also fantastic, but I really do feel that Super Mario Galaxy 2 is all that and more. I love the Starship Mario, I love the levels, I love the inclusion of Yoshi, I love the green stars that you get to search for at the end of the game. I just think that this game was so much fun and I love to go back to it every now and again. Coming in at number 4 is Super Mario Bros. 2. Now I had mentioned in a previous video that the first time I had ever played this was on the All-Stars collection back in 1990 whatever the fuck year it was. I was six years old. But I think this game is great. I love the level design. I love the characters. I love being able to select one of four. I love that Luigi plays vastly different than, say, Toad. I think they're both fantastic. It's just a fun game. I love the music. I love going back to this somewhat frequently. I usually play it a few times a year. And who doesn't love to throw eggs at Birdo? I mean... <laughs> so yeah, Super Mario Bros. 2. Fantastic game. Love to play it. Coming in at number 3 is Super Mario World 2 Yoshi's Island. Now, some people don't consider this a Mario game, some people consider it a Yoshi game. I get it. You could really swing both ways with that. But I'll include it on my list because I do see it as a Mario game and I think it's just absolutely amazing. I love the graphics and how everything seemed to have been drawn with crayons. I love the unique boss fights. I love the unique worlds. I love all the collectibles. This game just, it, it has it all. It's just such a fantastic game. The only problem with this game, to me, I think, is listening to Baby Mario cry, but I'm pretty good at it, so I thankfully don't have to hear him cry too often. So yeah, Super Mario World 2 Yoshi's Island, fantastic game. Coming in at number 2 is Super Mario World. Now, I got a Super Nintendo for my 5th birthday, so I've been playing this game since I was 5. It's a big part of my life. I grew up playing it with my mom, my cousin, and my brother. And I love the graphics, the controls, the cape I thought was fantastic, because we had played Mario 3, and, and the raccoon tail was, of course, a way to fly, but it worked differently. And then the cape was just a whole new way to fly, and I just thought it was amazing. I thought the inclusion of Yoshi was really cool, and the fact that there were different color Yoshis that all served different purposes. I loved how the world all connected together, like the vanilla dome, and the, the bridge, and then the force of illusion. I just thought it was so amazing how everything connected so beautifully. I love this game, that's why it's number two on my list. And coming in at number one, my favorite Mario game ever, of course, is Mario 3. I mean, who doesn't love Mario 3? Again, I've been playing Mario 3 since I was old enough to even play video games. Everything about it, I love the raccoon tail, I love the tanuki suit, the frog suit, the hammer brother suit, all the different worlds and the, the overworld maps. Everyone's favorite world seems to be World 4, the big world, but for me, I love World 5. I love how you start on the ground, and then you work your way up into the sky. I just think that's so cool. But this is a game I play quite regularly, and I don't think I'll ever get sick of this game. I even fucking have a tattoo of it. I don't know if you can see it here. But yeah, that's how much Mario 3 means to me. I fucking love this game. Now, when I was six, they came out with Super Mario All-Stars, which I very much looked forward to. But believe it or not, I'm one of those guys. I don't know if I'm in the majority or the minority here, probably the minority, but I'm one of those guys that I actually prefer to play all the games on the All-Stars on the NES, especially Mario 3. Like, if I'm playing Mario 3 nine times out of ten, I'm gonna be playing it on the NES. Every once in a while, it's it's fun to play the All-Stars version just to see the graphical updates and everything. The All-Stars version is objectively much better looking, but for some reason, I do like the look of the NES game better. In the All-Stars version, they, uh, you know, gave Mario and Luigi their own separate sprites. I actually prefer them to be palette swaps. I like it when Luigi looks identical to Mario, but just has green. I don't know, with, with Luigi looking the way he does in Mario 3 uh, for the All-Stars, I just, I don't know, he's taller and he kind of has a stupid looking chin. I, I just don't prefer his look as much in the All-Stars version. Another thing too is in the NES version when you get firepower, I like that you just turn orange. I used to call that Barbecue Mario because he had the same color as like barbecue chips like the bag of barbecue chips at least. But I just prefer it more to, to look orange when I have firepower rather than the white hat and the orange coveralls. So yeah, the All-Stars is great, but I would always rather play the, the NES versions of those games. So there you have it, guys. Those are my top five favorite Super Mario games. What are your favorite Mario games? Leave it down in the comments below. I was thinking too about maybe doing a video of Mario games I don't enjoy because as much as I love the Mario franchise, there were some games 
that I didn't love. And I'm not referring to Mario's Mystic, Mario's Time Machine. I'm talking about actual official games by Nintendo that I didn't care for. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Please leave a like, and I'll see you next week.